whenever you're ready sis I just have dead plants everywhere what's up you guys I got my teeth done in Colombia Colombia with dr. Gonzaga Tabaris it was oh, I should have did this off camera hold on let me see how much it was quote 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 so he quoted me for four thousand six hundred dollars which included top upper and lower veneers and these are composite not porcelain so after the deposit of 500 my let my remaining balance was four thousand one hundred right the four thousand six hundred total included the driver which took you like from the airport to the hotel hotel to the um, appointments back to the hotel back to the airport and then the hotel so he requires you to stay two nights I think <laughs> this is such a bad video okay so the <laughs> the cost included one night the cost included one night in the hotel room and then you had to pay for an extra one I'm pretty sure but I think you only had to stay for one day but I think you had to stay for two I think you had to stay for two days, but an extra day was just $70. Yeah, so I just stayed there for two nights. I am going to be putting some pictures and everything, like over here, of how my teeth look before because <laughs> the weather was gorgeous. The weather was beautiful. Hotel was gorgeous. Gorgeous. The room was a little small, but it was just me, so I didn't really mind. I'm trying to look through my pictures so I can remind myself because it happened a few months ago. The food was really good too. They had really, um, they had like their mix of pretty much, I didn't leave the hotel the hotel at all because they had a restaurant attached to the hotel they also had a spa there they had a pool they had i think that was it i think they had another rest restaurant attached to it as well no it was like a cafe they had like a little cafe attached to it as well which was really cute food was great it was very americanized it was a very touristy hotel it didn't seem like a really authentically colombian hotel that day i didn't do anything um the next morning was when i had my appointment my teeth appointment so first things first is I went there, I went to the, I got picked up, same driver, no, excuse me, different drivers. So every trip that I took was a different driver. I never had the same driver. The beginning part was really quick. I just had to gown up and um, I sat in the chair and then I had to get a deep cleaning first, right? And this deep cleaning was so uncomfortable. So after the teeth cleaning, I had already saw Dr. Tavares when I was coming in, you know? Um, talked to me super nice man after the, te the teeth cleaning he came in looked at my teeth said this is what we're gonna do da 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 that's when another doctor came in who was actually gonna do my teeth you know who was actually gonna do it so he came in and he started doing my teeth um, started doing my teeth he started putting the shots in my gums to shave them you know the shots didn't really hurt I don't know it was like a little pinch like it really wasn't it wasn't the most uncomfortable thing at all for me that was not the shots were not it what they did on the bottom was they put the needle like all the way through so it felt like it was in my chin you know like through this way and then in the top he just like put them like kind of just along my gum he didn't you know stick it up up here I started to laser away my gums and it was really unnerving like this this part was really um it wasn't it wasn't my favorite it wasn't my favorite thing <laughs> it felt like I don't know it felt it felt really um, intrusive it felt very intrusive <laughs> I could smell my flesh just burning underneath my nose and I could like feel the heat like I could feel the heat underneath my nose and it just felt like wow like there's fire on my mouth like there's like it's fire you know I kept trying to think of something else you know it was just very difficult because I kept feeling I kept feeling I kept feeling something like in my mouth like I kept feeling um I could feel like he was going a little too high for the shots that he had put into my mouth prior right so I was getting really nervous because I was like oh my god like I can feel it I can feel it like oh my god it's about to hurt it's about to hurt and I feel like it was like a it was a mental thing so I kept like pulling away a little bit I could tell he was getting really annoyed um so I just asked him I was like can you please like put some more and then he was like no you can't feel anything I was like no I know I know I know but like I don't know so can you just like keep it keep put a couple more shots in there because like I can feel it though uh, he put some more shots and made me feel a little better but I could still kind of feel it like I don't know I don't know and also like some of the is it Novocaine it got on my tongue um, and my tongue was feeling my tongue was feeling really obviously it was numb but it was just feeling like I was choking myself with my tongue because I couldn't feel it 
you know uh, just just trying to keep your mouth open for that that amount of time for that length of time because I think it was like what five six hours I want to say I don't remember exactly but you know what let me see four hours it's actually not that bad just trying to keep your mouth open and trying to swallow your spit because what they do is like they have like the little the little um like the the sucker you know like the thing that the suction the suck the it's not a hose well i guess it is a hose but it sucks you know what i'm talking about they have it like as you're laying back like they have it like just hanging on the side of your mouth like that so every all the spit that's over here like it's not like it's not getting it like it's not getting all the spit back here so i'm trying to swallow but my my tongue is numb and i'm trying not to choke myself you know because i'm nervous that like i'm gonna mess up my teeth like you know like i'm gonna, i can't i can't be in this much distress because i'm gonna mess up my teeth you know that's all that was going on in my head so i was just like it was kind of just like a strategic game in my mind that i was trying to play with myself like let's let's not cough let's not choke let's not die like let's just get it together just get your teeth done and go like that's it that's all i wanted to do he lasers both the top and the bottom the bottom was actually extra let me add that up okay so total that i paid was five thousand seven hundred after the gums he uh we took a break i was like looking at my teeth and i was like wow like i have teeth now because when i tell you that my teeth were so small my teeth were so baby that's when they started the process of putting the mold on my teeth i got the the whitest white i think it was like hollywood white or something that i got i was kind of scared because i thought it was just gonna look too white too bright especially me being brown skin i was just like wow like this is it's gonna be too much um but he was like i really recommend it blah 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 and i was just like okay i was like okay 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 he was just like putting the mold on my teeth uh he wasn't shaving anything down yet um, just kind of just getting like the overall just getting it in my mouth, you know And then he, they do all the shaping and stuff afterwards after getting it in my mouth I was looking at it. It was looking really bulky. So after the first mold on the top I when I had taken my break He he told me he was like when you look in the mirror like it's gonna look a little crazy because we haven't molded it You know, what I, mean? I mean we haven't shaped it. You know what I mean? So just just be aware of that just be aware that this is not how it's gonna look um, that took a, a lot of the time as well was the shaping it because obviously they wanted to look good after he felt like he was done after the doctor that was working on me felt like he was done um, that's when you got dr. Tabaras to come back in dr. Tabaras looked over everything and um, he was like uh, fix this fix that fix this you know he did a little bit on his own the other doctor came in again and fixed everything that dr. Tabaras said to fix looked at him again and then was like okay stamp of approval you look good when I eat, I realize that I uh, I have some big teeth. I got some big teeth now. It was the weirdest thing because I was trying to chew slowly because my teeth were so big in my mouth, like they felt so big that I couldn't move my mouth the way that I normally would when I ate food. And like my teeth were like, they would get in the way. So I would get really, not even I would get frustrated. I would get frustrated, yeah. I would get frustrated because I'm like, damn, like, I can't even eat the way I want to eat now. You know what I mean? In my mind, I was thinking that that, that feeling was going to be forever. You know, that I would always just feel like I had big teeth. That was something that completely went away. Oh, I didn't even talk about the worst parts. Okay, sorry. Let me go back. Let me go back. So as they're finishing my teeth, as they're finishing, the worst, the worst part for me, the very worst part for me was when they have to separate your teeth. So they take like this saw. And they like go in between each teeth, each tooth, and they like push it up, you know, to so that they can floss it. I think the whole flossing thing was the worst, the worst part of it. Like it was the worst part of it for me because in my mind I just kept picturing, like they they would always stop just, just almost grazing my gums. Like when they went up, like they almost, like they almost touched my gums. Like not really, but like like each time you're just like waiting for them to like hit your gums and it's gonna hurt so bad and you know it's gonna hurt so bad it was just so forceful you know because you have to be because like it's it's cured to your teeth so you have to be forceful to try to get it through uh the flossing also because after going through it with the with the saw they would do it with like regular floss and they would just 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 didn't care they would just ruin my life each time they did that just ruin my life i think that's it we can just end it here we can just end it. This is the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in my next one. Mwah, 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 mwah.